Welcome back guys, my name is Death Rock. We're going to be embarking on a new journey today. We're going to kick off with Black Myth Wukong, a game I've been watching trailers for for like the last four years or so. It's taken a while to release, so I'm excited to give it a go. Let's get into it. Yeah, so we're starting from here. God of War style. Okay. Flying numbers. So I guess these are gods. I will plead ignorance. I don't know a whole bunch of the lore surrounding Sun Wukong. I assume they call him. So I don't know a lot of what's actually going on here, but I guess we'll learn and figure it out as we go. Okay. So it's us against all of them. My master, <laughs> safe. The scriptures, sound. All I ever wanted was a life in my mountain, free from you and your so-called merits. Those high above don't trust me. <laughs> I understand that. And they send you and those knuckleheads to threaten me. To obey and serve once more. <laughs> I understand that too. But what I don't understand is... You bastards killing my kind! Okay, we've been killing the monkeys. Kill the dog. Stay back! Stupid dog. Okay, he doesn't care about the dog. <laughs> but they're all dogs. They're like Marcus. dog clan. He's not just any monkey. He's a monkey of merit. A monkey was made Buddha once. None other than me can challenge him to a duel. Look, monkey. I don't make a habit of fighting someone I've bested before. Here's my offer. If you lose, I'll take you to the Celestial Court. They will stay and level your mountain. But if I lose, I shall certainly take revenge. And they will level your mountain nonetheless. How tragic would that be, huh? You are one of the court. We don't need to resort to violence. I'm pretty sure we do need to resort to violence. How about you bend the knees, admit the wrongs, mm. and we can put this behind us. We'll never bend the knee. <laughs> All these years, except for that 
Pig. You're the one who talks the tallest tales. Good. I am entertained. Speaking of entertainment, wouldn't it be fun if I pluck your extra eye out for my snack and allow you to keep the other two? Because I'd hate to let you miss how I'll slaughter each mongrel of the court. Those below, those above, and that black mutt of yours. Come at me, all of you. Okay, just one at a time. All right, lock on target. Light attack. Okay. Dark Souls vibes. Roll, dodge, lock on. I'm not rolling or dodging right now. Okay, not doing great, but that's okay. Good dang of it. Heavy attack, triangle. I don't. Do I have a health bar? I don't have a health bar. Guess maybe I can't die. I'm supposed to be a god after all, so. I don't really know what's happening right now. The victorious fighting Buddha. Have you any idea how many would give their everything for immortality? Immortality? Okay. So you are immortal. <laughs> for that word, all realms and beings have ruined themselves. Okay. <gasps> Okay, so there's a bunch of animation locking with the movement, so you've got to be careful you don't start to movement when he does, otherwise you get locked. And as I say that, I proceed to get myself locked into animations. There's a bunch of things on the right-hand side of the screen, I don't know what that is. R2. Oh. Solid. Oh, okay, cool. Oh, it's got a cooldown. A pluck of many. Oh, shadow clones. Oh, that's exciting. As I understand it, I believe both Goku from Dragon Ball and Naruto are kind of loosely based on Sun Wukong. The Celestial Court welcomes you, foul monkey, yet you remain untamed. None shall save you now. <laughs> Dear brother, your edge needs home. Good. I was in need of a back scratcher. <laughs> Alrighty, let's go for gold. Pretty nice doing more stuff. Have I got invisible? Immobilize. Oh, cool. Okay. So it lasts for like one hit. And the stone thing. It's almost like a parry, I think. Yeah. Kind of makes them stagger back and, and kind of parry them. A pluck of many. Shadow Kajitsu. I don't even know what's happening.
The scale of this is pretty ridiculous. <laughs> Did the first drum play an instrument? It's interesting, but like he played like a guitar or something. I sent a shockwave down. Foul monkey! He's Twist making the expert. We make the whole thing big. The stick. Did you just take the whole mountain down? No. Just a small part. Rat, but we are not happy. You call that a duel? The glare up here is dazzling. Fight me in the woods if you have the guts. Oh, cool. We can become a chicken. And he is a dove. Okay, no, he's probably an eagle or something. It's okay, it's not a chicken. A hawk, maybe? What what is happening? What's that? Oh uh, It's the crown thing? the shape of the loading screen icon. I have no idea what that is. Okay. Thus I assume we are defeated. And our mountain got rocked, literally. And so ends the last tale of Sun Wukong. Sun? A hero who treasured his freedom above all else. Buddhahood he attained, yes. But cumbersome he found the celestial rules. For he yearned to come back and to revel in the simple joys with us. Little did he know, his choice to forgo the life above only fueled their mistrust. So he wasn't down with management, basically. He was not a team player. <sighs> mm. Interesting hands. This stone has stood for countless days on the mountain. Since my youth, they said that his remains lie within it. <clears throat> Unbegotten, undying, such is the nature of a stone monkey. Though his body was broken, his spirit endures. Into six relics he turned, and separately they escaped, choosing to stay hidden. Okay, so I'm guessing we gotta go get the six relics. Those are the six senses of the great sage. Mm. Yet no one has ever seen them. Okay. Not in centuries. I'm old now. Venture through all the lands, I cannot. Yet among you, there might be one who is destined. One that should recover all his scattered relics. And upon the return of the relics to Mount Tuago, he may yet rise again. Alrighty, get the relics. Bring Sun Wukong back to life. Easy. Got you. Pretty epic start. So I've seen a bunch of reviews and everyone's kind of saying, is this game of the year? We'll see. 
Chapter 1 Black Cloud Red Fire Let's go. On the gold bend the toll life of human or for gold. Nowhere better than a home. A peach. We better death than ever grow. Huh? Listen, yeah. bro. You see? What bliss my face well, shows. Oh, yes. <laughs> Luck's around the corner. Seems like he just fell from a oh, fruit yes. tree here. Perfect timing. This peach knew I needed a snack. <laughs> you sneaky rascal. Damn okay. fool me. I'll make sure you regret it. <laughs> so we can transform into a peach and we've got the stick. Okay. I don't quite get how. I can't do the heavy attack. Oh, okay, he does a heavy attack. You're still as mischievous as ever, eh? Who's talking? Okay, let's crack on. animation oh okay so this is not as unforgiving as souls you don't just fall off everywhere so that's i want to sprint i don't know if i like that i kind of like needing to what's this gather age ginseng okay i kind of like needing to be careful i'm kind of thinking about what i'm doing now i know i can't dive I walk to the edge. Okay. Interesting decision. Onward and upward, I guess. Up the stairs. Okay, two paths. Is that dude slightly bigger than the normal? Wolves, dogs? Charged heavy attack. Triangle. Hold to charge and build up focus. Hold heavy attack to charge. Charging costs stamina but quickly builds up focus. Okay. Oh, is this telling me where to go? Little sparkly bits? Okay. Okay, so I've got a... Cool, 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 cool. No, no, it's the same. Oh, I so said there's that and then... Oh, bam! A one shot. Okay. I assume that'll only work on the smaller dudes. Will. Tiny piece of gold. Stone spirit. What's will? I think I got will from the first two guys I fought as well. This guy's got an axe. Oh, cool. Like ends up jumping super high, so jump in triangle. That's pretty cool. Okay, and jump in like light attack kind of brings him down super quick. Interesting. That's cool. Okay, let's follow the sparkly bits. What do we have here? Uh, what you waiting for? Pluck your hair and make an offer. <laughs> Pluck your hair and make an offer. Okay, so the hair becomes intense. Hey, hey, wait! I, the keeper of Black Wind Mountain, have long been waiting for your arrival. I have questions about his face. Oh, his spitting image? I'd say. Okay. Ahead is Guan Yin Temple. Once it was bustling with worshippers. Before it was ruined by that fire. And now there's probably uh, dogs all over it. Wolf people. Then the temple was rebuilt. 
what good is it to rebuild a temple if the goodwill of men has been burnt to ashes? I don't know, my small and old friend. You've forgotten this place, but they haven't forgotten you. Okay. <laughs> That's a tough one. Good luck to you. I don't really know if he helped anything. Oh, for incense. Rest travel. Trailblazer's gift. Okay, so it's a bonfire. Like, like Dark Souls. Okay, Trailblazer's gift, if I remember correctly, I bought the Deluxe Edition, I want to call it. Collector's Edition. Deluxe Edition. Gifts. Folk Opera. Mask. Alms giving armor. Leather braces. Buskins. Cloud staff and a wooden chime. Okay, let's we'll grab it. Collect. Collect everything. Okay, cool. Travel. Forest of Wolves. Front Hills. So, I assume... This is where we are. So, within the Forest of Wolves, we're at the Front Hills. Okay, so we can't go anywhere. This is the very first one. We can rest. I'd assume exactly the same thing happens as a Souls game. Let's just kind of squiz back here. Yep. Okay. Stuff respawns. Fair. Um, okay. So. Okay. Equipment. Inventory. Journal. Lesser Yaguais. We've got Wolf Scout. Wolf Sworn Sword. And a Wolf Stalwart. It's the axe dude. Sworn sword and the wolf scout. So you, yeah, I think you tend to see these two together. And this guy with the axe on his own every now and then. Inventory. We've got incense trail talisman. Immediately free soul from the body and guide it back. Okay, so it's like a homeward bone, I guess, from Dark Souls. And kind of thing. Materials for crafting armor, crafting weapons. Trade could be done at the Keeper's Shrine. Okay, so trade. Coconut wine. Each sip restores 33% of maximum health. Oh. Wine does restore your health. Facts. This can be used to make medicines. A ginseng. Okay, so I'm sensing quite a bit of crafting coming up. Sort by default. Okay, so you can assign, I guess, individual ingredients and stuff to... Um, the D-pad did not mean to exit. So, equip abilities. Okay, I'm not going to touch that yet. Um, equipment. So, it does look cool. I kind of like the base look. But let's see what we have. Okay, so it's just kind of a nice and humble staff to a bit of a fancier looking staff. Okay, don't know what that is, we don't have anything for their head. Folk Opera moderately increases the will gain from defeating the enemy. So see we also get a plus seven on defense there, so I guess it's, it's not really cheating, but it's just kind of giving you a leg up for the start of the game. Plus nine and increased will, so I'm guessing it'll help get your general currency, you know, Kind of up to par faster. New curios. Curio 1, Curio 2. What's this? When it chimes, slightly increases movement speed. We'll not say no to that. Alrighty. Alright. Everything looks pretty cool. I don't know what you'd call the mask and this general armor. But he looks cool. Let's crack on. Okay, this dude's got a shield. Okay, okay, okay. So I've got to pay attention to that. The heavy attack doesn't work the same way as it did in the first fight with the boss. How does this charge thing work? 
Okay. So it gives me... It fills up like a little bead in the bottom right hand corner. If I charge it, it's got a gauge that goes up. Get a little bead. Okay, and then he kind of uses that little bead immediately with, with the attack. Powers up. I don't know exactly. I'm sure... Forest, of course. I'm sure it'll become more apparent how it all works as we go. So let's go shield, dude. I'm say it feels relatively, it's nice and smooth. Um, the general, like, light attack is nice and quick. Feels good. Movement feels nice and smooth. Okay, big X, dude. So now, he whacked me straight in the face. Gather R2. Purple. Lingji. I want to say Lingji. I'd assume that's correct. Okay, so there's stuff down there. And there's stuff down there. Which way? Let's come over here and have a quick look. Your face looks familiar. I don't know who you're talking about. Oh god, this is a boss. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, so far, not so bad. Okay, okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Forgive me. I'm sorry. What happened? Oh, it's that freezy thing. Uh. Okay. <laughs> it's been a while. But the immobilized spell still works like a charm. Okay, so he did it. This little dude did it. Okay. Since Is that a monkey hand? From Mount Huaguo, it won't hurt to teach you a handy trick. Now, here okay. we go. Give me your hand. Okay. A simple hand gesture can bind the enemy in place. There you go. Should you come across any miscreants, just point your finger at them and release this spell. You'll be able to hold them in place while giving yourself a breather. Who's voicing Sadly, this little dude? Mine is but a humble trick. Its power will wear off within a few short moments. I want to say it's, it's like good enough against boneheads like this one. <laughs> Boneheads. Anyway, just consider it an ace up your sleeve. Cool. No! Run away, the little dude. These days know no manners. Fear not. The Teach him a lesson with your new spell. Okay, so well, bam. Okay, breaks out of it relatively fast. Dude's gone. Okay. I'd assume that's the way to go, but there was other stuff. So, okay. I think I'm supposed to look elsewhere first. I suppose there's a degree of exploration required. And you got to find stuff for yourself. The game's not going to spoon feed you everything. What am I seeing? Is this a monkey? And then? Went down here. But I can't go down there, apparently. Okay. What's on the statue? Gather. Earwax. Hmm. Skanda of form. Key item. Okay. Okay. 
Skanda of Form. Let's pick up some stuff as we go, gather. you guys guarding a fancy flower Jinshin Jinshin okay isn't Jinshin that stuff they used to make hello what are we dealing with a frog a frog not a dog oh okay cool 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 Shade Lotus. And now I'm getting concerned because now it looks like there's a. Okay. Another boss. There's a whole path back here. I actually think this area is sealed off. Okay. So I think that other boss we fought was kind of the right way to progress. But we got these optional doodads. Oh, look at the, how much health did he take off me? Use L1 board to recover. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Here we drink it. Go. Cool. Oof, you get stuck in that jumping animation and you get like whacked mid air and you can't do anything about it. A little bit annoying, but okay, that's fine. What is this gather? Green stuff. Wool. Is that it? Just wool. Okay. Alrighty. Onward and upward. So I'd assume we're going all the way back past this boss. We just defeated to get the freezy thing immobilized. Would have been cool if you can string together like some movement stuff. Kind of like Warframe style. You know. A slide, a jump, a spin. Was it bullet time? Okay, self advance and sparks. Open self advance to awaken talents, level up to gain sparks and awaken more abilities and spell sparks will not be lost upon resurrection. Okay, so you don't lose them. That's cool. Okay, so let's have a look quickly. Inventory, what's new here? So we got new ingredients for medicines, 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 medicines. Okay. And then we got the Skada of form. Man shrinks at odor, but smiles at beauty, which is only natural. Once hidden inside the Buddha's head, this treasure has a secret yet to be revealed. Cool. Uh, Yagwai Chief's Bull Guard. Okay, so that's the big dude. Lesser Yagwai's croaky. Okay, so a Crokey is the frog dude, and a crow diviner is the big crow dude thing. We just fought. And we've got a soldier now, it's the guy with the shield. Alrighty. Cool, Yagwai Chiefs, we just got the bull guard kings and random other characters. Okay. The equipment, we are fine. Self advance. We got spells and we got abilities. I think mysticism. I think what I want to do is maybe general health, stamina, that kind of thing to start with. The stamina is under the health bar on the left. And when you're rolling around, it eats the stamina. And the bar on the right is a charge bar specifically for the attack. Okay. So each talent level moderately accrues. Increases health, there and stamina. So let's do, we got two, so let's do one health. Let's do one stamina for now. We're just going kind of neutral game. This is awakened, so what is it? Uh, increases damage dealt to immobilized enemies. Okay, so it's like a debuff. Hitting an immobilized enemy with a light attack slightly extends the duration of the next immobilization inflicted on them. 
This effect can stack up to five times. Okay, interesting. Okay, so you can buff it up. So we got smash stances, pillar stance, thrust stance, pillar stance. He stands on the stick. Okay. Thrust stance, I'm guessing you what, like pole arm. So you charge it up. Super amazingly. And then three times. So yeah, and then the pole grows. Okay. Smash stance. One, two. Okay. Let us move on. Nice big open area to clear through. Let's have a go. Is that a monkey or am I just seeing that? Is that a monkey? Yes. That is a monkey. Oh, we got another spark. Should we... Okay. Let us allocate it out somewhere. Skin abilities again. Stamina. Each challenge level moderately reduces the stamina cost of sprinting. Nah. Cost of dodging, maybe. Light attack starter. Engage distance. Okay, so it closes your distance when you, like, staff spin. So moving forward while using star spin initiates mobile spin. The destined one. Okay, so are we are the destined one apparently. He spins his staff around his body deflecting projectiles. So okay, let's do this one. The destined one. Okay, it's pretty cool. So you can deflect arrows and stuff like that. I wonder, I wonder how many types of projectiles we're going to have in the game. How many things you'd need to... I guess there's guys down here. Yeah, let's maybe... Clear this out first. Froggy. I could have sworn I dodged, but cool, cool, cool. Dodge straight into the attack. Oh! Okay, and if you're near them when they explode, you kind of get poisoned. There's a poison bar. Okay. Keep that in mind. Okay, there's... Is this a frog? No, it's a rock. Is it? It's a rock. Not the way. Boom. Okay. Quick and easy. Okay, let's make our way back up. Some stuff to collect. What is this? Aged ginseng again. Sure, I had some of that. There wasn't like a little section in the middle here, right? No. No, oh, I was thinking there was something underneath we could jump down. Our mighty, king's got serious power. mighty King, you say? Boom. Go tell your Mighty King. Okay, what's over here first? Okay. Pots with money. Well, I assume it's money. I don't actually know if it is money yet. But the will, the will thing, it looks like the amount we're getting of it, it must be some kind of currency. Meditate. With a nice view. Boom. I'm guessing the, that's the you are safe and now resting, meditating. I don't know, but this isn't. This isn't where you rest. You rest 
at those little altars where you light the incense from your hair. Okay. And the environments are done really well. So maybe this is just like a an appreciation piece. Like come sit here, meditate, take in your surroundings. Oh, so it took my health up quite a bit and gave me a spark, I guess. Advance, we got a spark. Staff stances, let's see. Mm. Should we try mysticism, maybe? Let's maybe do... Increase the damage dealt. I feel like whenever we get to like the next boss or whatever, it might be something to deal with. And having a bit of a debuff might be nice. You never know. Let's see. Oh, Mr. Plant, gather. Genshin. Okay, through here. Up, up and away. Offer incense. Storm. Fire. Evil repelling medicament. Medicament? Medicament. Medicament. I'm not sure. Damage reduction. For a long duration. Body cooling powder burn resistance. Makes sense. Anti-miasma powder for poison. Okay, cool. Then we've got general, I guess, crafting items. We've got cell. Tiny piece of gold. Treasure, tiny piece of gold. Its origin indiscernible. Perhaps some trade could be done at the Keeper's Shrine. This is the Keeper's Shrine. So this is meant to be sold. Oh, we can sell the full amount we don't have to sell one at a time self-advanced reignite the sparks i don't know what that does i'm not going to do that let's race to get health back where's his helmet hey, wait. oh cutscene okay you can just that's fine in, do you? It's well not that simple. yes kind of did think we could just parade in let me transform you into a golden cicada so you Why? can follow the fires ahead and scout this mountain unnoticed. Fly! <laughs> okay. It might be humble, but my shrine is very versatile. Okay. Okay. Depths of Black Wind Mountain, there are secrets galore. The cicada form, they help you explore. Huh? But beware, of you. this form wonder. does not I last for if there's anything Should you find yourself them. lost, just follow my voice. Now, off you go. Okay, cool. So, I'm assuming. Even though how do you go like up and down? Or do you just kind of I just kind of aim in that direction? What is this? Oh, it's like a like more humanoidy looking dude, I don't know, an ogre or something? area down here it's quite a big area a little patch under uh, me tubber him hey? no idea bro and then what is that no 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 
What is that? No, uh, okay. Okay. Um, kind of try to remember my way back. There was a bunch of stuff on the path that I traveled to get here. I think the start is somewhere over there. If I'm correct. I might be very not correct. So let's kind of work. Don't, don't, don't do that. Okay, so I went, yep, here's the dudes right in the beginning. Just deal with them quickly. I assume the idea is the cicada beetle will help generally scout areas, but you don't necessarily have to use it. And maybe it'll come more in handy later on. Maybe you can't reach certain areas by yourself and you need to turn into the beetle to get there. Um... But I think in this regard, it kind of pays off more to cover the ground. Okay, can't go there. It's like invisible wall vibes. You can't go over stuff. Okay, can't actually get there. Okay, that's fine. Gather. What's happening up here? What was up, bro? You dead. Oh, here's that other dude. Drop your treasures and oh, he still got me. Boom. Got a spark. Nice. Hey, but what do you have for me? Tiny piece of gold. Evil repelling medicament. Medicament? Still don't know. I have to figure that one out. That's fine. Did I come up here? I seem to not remember actually coming up here. There's a little path going down that way. Oh, this is where we came from. Okay, so... If you can access the path, it allows you to drop down. So that makes sense. Oops. Did not mean to do that. Sorry. Almost gave myself a fright. So up here, I assume it's just going to meet up with a path at the bottom, but I still want to check. Yeah, literally. Is this dude fancier than that? No, he's not. Okay, what are we looking at here? A boss, but now... There's still like a whole area on the other side I didn't really look at. But okay, let's guess we deal with him first. Since we're here. Let's just do it. Oh, it's not a boss. No, I thought it was a boss. It's the bird dude. Actually really not that bad. Okay. But frame rates here by the water. That's interesting. Water bad. Okay. And join this part. Which seems like it just goes under that bridge over there. And this part. Goes to that exact part as well. So, okay. Let's see here under the bridge. Perform a spinning block. What? What? Okay. 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 So he's. So he's up, must be up on the bridge. Monkey is here. Who? Who? Where are? Where are you? Ah. Oh. Okay, that was the little bridge 
dude with the axe was over there and that whatever that is is over there i'm gonna keep looking around for now i'm not really uh interested in talking to that dude just yet did he see me i, I no i don't think he did is that a big dude over there okay, we'll have to see Oh, okay. Look, keep doing it. What are you doing? Okay, so you got to hold it in. Don't do what I did. Be better. And I fell. Cool, cool. There we go, right back up. Portraits update. Okay, portraits updated. I have to go check. Oh, I assume it's in the bestiary thing. There's one more. Yaogwai now with a bow. Okay, these are just two normal schmoes. Okay. Kaboom. Little pick up. Little pick me up. And over here we swing right back to this dude. There's a plant. Okay. There's one... section more I think the exit to this no I don't know about this big blue dude okay so this is the area black boss I guess so let's go bro hmm, another monkey I see why don't you lay down your weapon and join me in goodness mercy? Wang Ji. Ji Zi. Doesn't matter, let's go. Look at that extra damage coming in. Andy with the immobilized. What the heck? Okay, just keep moving, keep dodging. Keep dodging and don't get... Oh, that was a cool dodge. Get like an after image. I'm trying, I'm trying, okay. Let me freeze him so I can get some of my stamina back. Okay, okay. Got you, got you, got you. Ooh. Let me heal up rather than. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Oh, he got me. He got me. Ow. I know the pain is coming even before it hits me. Almost there, almost there, almost there. There we go. Not too bad. Ooh, three sparks. The destined one. Okay. Pick up. What do we get? Red tides. As the feral flurry intensifies with each fierce thrust, the flames do rise, transform into a wolf guai, and inflict scorch bane on the enemy with each attack. Okay. So I can become a wolf now. Isn't that interesting? Transformation. Weapons valuable valuables cherished by Yao Guais often carry lingering obsessions from their deceased owners. Collecting them grants the ability to briefly take on their forms in combat each transformation has its own strengths making them worth experimenting with 
Okay. Transformations continually, continuously consume might and require full gauge to initiate. Using spells during a transformation further depletes might. And once it is fully depleted, detransformation occurs automatically. Subsequently, might will gradually recover. Okay. Cool. So might for transformations. And okay. Ring a bell. I didn't even know I was supposed to ring a bell. But it's here and I'm here. Let's do it. Now we can get to Anor Londo. You just had to make some noise, did you? Ah. Now everyone knows you're here. When Good, they must know. So grand echoes in the forest, the Alguais will surely be alarmed. This bell here can't be... Okay, no. I thought we could smack it and ring it or something, but I guess not. Alrighty. So before we even take on this blue dude, I think. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Maybe we'll just give it a try quickly. To see transformation red tides. I'll just try it on this guy and see how it goes. I don't really know. This dude is big. If this dude is very big, okay, he's much bigger than some of the other ones. Oh, he's got so much health. I don't feel it possible. Oh, yeah. Oh, he took so much health. Ooh, he smacks hard. Oh, back to monkey form. Okay, okay. So, I don't think he's impossible to beat, but... Well, that's unfortunate. First death. Forest of Wolves. Okay, so obviously back at the bonfire type area. Ah, a bit of a slug back. Now, do I drop anything with that death? I wonder. Actually, not sure. I was dodging. I wonder. I don't... Do we drop will? So maybe the will I've been carrying? Do I lose it? I don't know. Let's go check. Oh, there's a little PC off to the side here. I don't think I went through here at all. I don't see anything on the ground. I died, I think, over here-ish. I don't see anything. Okay, so there's an opening there. So I guess we could pass him. Okay, so doing that uses that up really quickly. Can I stop him? I can stop him. Oh, and I can knock him down. Okay. I'm scared, I'm afraid, I'm sorry. Oh boy. Does this go any bigger? What the heck? That was like a Kamehameha wave. What? Oh, oh. I have an idea. Follow me, please. Both of you. This way, please. At a glacial pace, please. Okay, we locked onto this dude. Are you following? I 
I don't know if this dude is a buddy. Oh no. Oh, he fell over. <gasps> what happened there? He ran into the pillar and got knocked over. Okay, he outright killed that other dude, so... I really need to pay attention to the Kamehameha wave. Okay, at least I get health. A one. At least I get like separate health bar. Let's mobilize him. Doesn't last long on him. Okay, we need to get out of dodge. Uh, I don't know if I'm in. Need to. Whoa, okay, okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, bro. Really sorry, I'm stuck. I need to immobilize, I don't have stamina. <laughs> oh. uh, please be merciful. I can immobilize again, but I don't know if I should right away. It's not even half health. Oh, I fell over. Okay. So if you hit him in the face... Which I can't do every single time. Oh, I'm gonna die. Move, move, move. Okay, he's doing that thing. At least he's stuck. Oh, he attacked. He attacked one of the other little dudes came down to talk to him. <laughs> to talk to him. Oh, I didn't see it coming. close I've got transformation again oh I got it what the heck wandering white okay cool Oof. alrighty Gets eye beads, curious. Oh, okay, now they're actually telling me how to use this dude. I've already killed something. But okay, what do I do here? R2, oh, okay, I think I need to transform back. Okay, so heavy attack, light attack, moon dance. That's legit the move he was doing, okay. How many games do you actually get to be the boss in? That's pretty cool, you fight the boss, you kill the boss, you can become the boss. Oh. Can we jump? Does he sprint? Okay. Okay, okay, okay. I get it, I get it. Oh, I'm so weak. Take. Cannot absorb spirits without guidance. Oh, okay. Really freaking out. That was weird, like graphical glitch when I kind of pan the camera. Okay, 
so I need guidance. Was I maybe not supposed to fight the dude now, or maybe that spirit just kind kind of floats here? I don't know. Okay. Well, I think which is the way I'm supposed to go this way. Alrighty. Let's go down this way then. I have no health. I got wrecked. Properly wrecked. Let's see what we have. I'm gonna see if I can whack this. Can I? Did I? I did whack it and broke it. I don't think I got anything for it though. Oh no, it is there. I didn't whack it, didn't break it. Oh well, okay, that's fine. Let us continue. Like breaking buckets for wool. This is supposed to be lanterns, right, for light. Oh. What? Okay, still can't fall off. Got a bit worried there for a sec. Okay, we're coming to another big area. I'm a little bit worried because I don't have health. All right, guys, we're going to call the episode there. Thank you so much for stopping by and watching. Hope to see you in the next one. If you enjoyed it, please subscribe, drop a like. It'll really help the channel grow. Catch you in the next one.